Spence and Blair being together is kind of my fault. So this is uh, this is kind of my doing. So you're welcome. Kind of the small talk starts happening, and everybody's waiting for those two to kind of engage. They don't. So Blair and I, you know, we're talking, and finally Spencer starts chiming in, and he starts you know, talking to it. Like, sweet, great, this is going so Well, not too long after that, Blair tells him that she wants to move to New York City to, like, you know, for a career and that kind of that stuff. And Spence immediately pipes in with Robusto and says, uh, oh, I think that's a great idea. You should move. Let me know, let me know, let me know when you get back. Let me know, let me know, let me know when you get back. Let me know, let me know, let me know when you get back. Let me know when you get back. Let me know, let me get that. You gotta put it in forward. Don't act like you've never been chauffeured. You gotta put it in forward. Cause I got something for ya. But, uh, as Spencer's you know, kept coming around and uh, kept hanging out, you know, uh, got to know him a little bit more. And so then, uh, I think Melanie says, you know, this, this might be serious. This might be the, you know, the one. And I'm like, oh, 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 you know, okay, now what's his name? <laughs> Go ahead and start the music. <laughs> when Spencer was a sophomore, he had seen this girl leaving hit one of his classes a couple times and somehow I convinced him to look up her number call her ask her on a date and she had no idea who he was and of course she said no <laughs> so in one in one encounter I taught him how uh, to be humble and how to be patient your perfume has got me in a daze you're calling all the shots I just want to stay I just want you She's been our baby girl, you know, and uh, she just lights up the room, you know, when she goes. When you're at a party or in a crowded room, you, you look for Blair and you go to Blair because she makes you feel comfortable, she makes you feel loved, you know that you're going to laugh, and you feel like you, you matter. You're the most important person in the room when you're with Blair. Because I just wanted you, I just wanted you, I still want you. When Spencer came along, I, I knew he was perfect for Blair. And he just, he brings out the absolute best in her. Even the weird side that I know not everyone has seen in this room, but Blair's weird. <laughs> and I love that. You could understand, you could be my girl, I could be your man. Um, we have, we were so scared who you would end up with in life. Honestly. And then came Blair. And um, I can speak from me and Lacey. It's been such a uh, surprise, but a fantastic one that you've been in his life. That I've never seen two people truly become themselves when they find their person. Um, and we seems sounding a little cheesy here. In this case, their soulmate. It's, uh, it's gonna be fun. I have a third dog, and. Uh, so we're gonna have a lot of fun. Cause I just wanna go. I just wanna go. Cause I just wanna stay all night. Stay all night. Come on, stay all night. Stay all night. Come on, come on. Got me in the dance. I was thinking sitting here does have the perfect plan and to bring these two together is a great example of it. February 12, 1992, my life changed forever for the better because my best friend and little sister Blair was born. April 24th, 1994 was another great day. It was the day that Blair's best friend was born. And although 
we didn't know it at the time, it was also a very special day. January 17th, 2018, the day that my best friend met her best friend April 17th, 2021. It's going to be a great day because it's the start of something new. You are joining together as husband and wife and becoming your own new family. You may kiss your bride. <laughs> I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Spencer Berry. Let me know, let me know, let me know when you get back. Let me know, let me know, let me know when you get back. Let me know, let me know, let me know when you get back. Let me know when you get back. Let me know, let me get back. You gotta put it in forward. Don't act like you've never been chauffeur. coming along at exactly the right time because in a few months I need somebody to help me get the Christmas tree out of the attic. Let me know, let me know, let me know when you get back. Let me know, let me know. Let me know, let me know, let me know when you get back. Let me know, let me know, let me know when you get back. Let me know when you get back. Let me know, let me get back. You gotta put it